Hey, what's up, YouTube? Uh, we're back again. A uh, bunch of stuff lately. I've been buying things on Marketplace, and I've been going to a lot of flea markets. Um, so I'm going to have to break it up into different videos. You can see in the background here, there's uh, five cases. That's um, part of a collection that I picked up today uh, that I haven't gone through yet. So that'll be in a separate video. Um, what I'm going to show you today is first the stuff that I picked out from a marketplace listing that I bought a while back. I already went through it. There was a lot of junk. So I picked out the things that were interesting. Um, and then I went to a flea market today that had a lot of good stuff uh, from a couple different vendors and just, you know, a couple of interesting things. Um, so I'm going to start really quick with uh, this Facebook call from last week. Uh, just a bunch of random stuff that was in this uh, box of Hot Wheels, including some newer stuff. Here's an Audi RS Avant. I mean, this is, I think you can still find those on the pegs. Uh, here's a really cool tow truck from Matchbox. I thought that was really cool. I hadn't seen this one yet. Um, so I was really interested in this and definitely one that I decided to keep. Um, let's see, what's this? Another newer one, uh, the Jaguar. There's another race car. A little beat up. Um, so anyway, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with all these. The ones that are not absolute garbage, I pull aside. And then I have a booth in a flea market, and I sell some of the better ones there. This is Motor Max, which I hadn't actually even encountered this brand before. And it's, it's a sweet car, I guess. I don't know. Now that I look at it, in better light it looks kind of i don't know i don't know how i feel about that one <laughs> let's see now we got uh let's here's an ambulance pretty cool this is what casting is this the custom 77 dodge but that's pretty cool that's a, a really cool use of that one i like that here's a maisto i could tell by looking at it uh, volkswagen convertible yep maisto Uh, this has got to be, oh, this is Motormax. How about that? World's best delivery truck. Okay, here's a, this has got to be a Cadillac. Yep. It's a DeVille. Pretty nice, not too badly used. This one actually was on card, but the card was completely destroyed. It's one of these Matchbox, uh, what is it, Super Duty, Ford Super Duty. I thought this was cool. I mean, it's kind of weird looking <laughs> with all the wheels, but uh, I don't know if this was a bus. What is this casting? Uh, I, can't I can't read that. I could try, but maybe you guys can. Oh, that's better. Motorhome, there you go. Um, but it's like a news van. I thought that was really sweet. Uh, okay, here's one of these guys. What is this, Purple Passion? I don't even know. Looks familiar. Uh, fantasy casting of some sort. I don't really know. You guys tell me. Uh, this was pretty cool. Nice race car. And this camera is pretty good, I gotta say. <laughs> I struggled to see some of this stuff, but I can see it just fine on the camera. Uh, and this is cool. This is a Hot Wheels blown Camaro. Um, but look at the wheels. I don't know what this is from. Uh, looks kind of like a higher end release. Uh, some paint chips, which sucks, but definitely a cool one. Here is another Avant. Yellow. Um, a little beat up. But uh, one I do not have, so pretty cool. Still rolls. You got a little bit of construction equipment in that box. This is the only one that was worth keeping in my mind. It's an old Hot Wheels. Back that up a little bit. And then there was this one as well, which I don't really know much about it. It's Matchbox. Um, it's just a tractor plow. It's like <laughs> white and gold. 
It's like a holiday edition. I don't know. Okay, then we've got... What have we got? Uh, Mercury. Probably should have known. Eventually, I'm going to know by looking at them. I would have guessed that. One of the flame versions. Okay, this one here. This was the re this was what sold me on the collection. I saw this car sticking out of the box in the photo, and it's in really nice shape. Um, you know, Hotbird, Firebird, whatever it is. I'm not even really sure what the casting is, but whenever you see something like this in a box, it's pretty clear that there was a kid, or at least it's possible there was a kid. Uh, who's buying new cars and inherited cars from his father or something. And then that way you see stuff like this. So I took a chance on it. It didn't really pay off. This is honestly probably the coolest thing. But it's in really nice shape. So, and I didn't have it. So I'm all right with it. Okay, this, I don't really know exactly what this is. Porsche, I'm guessing. What does that say? Does that say? Yeah, so this is a Porsche. I don't know what the brand is, and I don't know. I really don't know. What does that say? Yeah, made in China. I don't know. It's a smaller scale, but uh, pretty cool. Some sort of Baja van. A couple of Formula racers. Here's a, a Maisto. Doesn't roll at all. That's probably going to go. Oh, there it goes. It rolls a little bit. And here is uh, Majorette. It still rolls pretty good. This uh, looks like one would have come out of one of those John Deere play sets. Um, but it's pretty cool. It's got some weight to it. Plastic body, but a metal base. Hmm. <clears throat> I thought this looked interesting. I don't know what it is. There's not really much information on the bottom here. Um, you know, it's just a police minivan, I guess. Uh, okay, this was pretty cool. This is a Matchbox. It's a Shelby. Um, and that's pretty cool. It's actually in really nice condition. Rolls extremely well. Okay, another matchbox. This one is, I can't even read it. It's, it's 1969 something, I can't read it. Eyes are going, sorry guys. Uh, but that's pretty cool, a little chipped, but definitely a nice older looking car. Oh, it's got a bent axle or something. It wants to turn, but definitely a cool car. And then the last one is uh, this uh, Grave Digger. And I think the casting is, I don't know. Is it on Ford? I don't know. I don't know. It's got, the wheels are not doing too well here. Yeah, that one might not be a keeper. So that was the only things that I saw as decent out of the first collection. But from the same people, I bought a big box of like little green men. It had this in it which I thought was so cool, man. I mean, if that's not iconic, I've never seen this before and I didn't care how much it cost, I was gonna buy it. Turned out it was $1.50. Um, so there you have it. Um, okay, then we move on to the stuff from today. <clears throat> I actually went to a Walgreens. I always check their pullbacks and they had some uh, Fast and Furious pullbacks. Uh, so I definitely had to pick up the Skyline. This is one of the castings I collect in 164th scale. Um, so had to get that. And of course, you always got to get this one. Pretty badass. All right. Now we'll move on. Let's see. There was a flea market and I was looking all over the place and they had die cast in every single booth. And in one of them, I found one of these cases right here, the 24, uh, 48 car carry case full of cars for 25 bucks. So I got it, took a chance. Uh, you guys are going to look at it with me. I have no idea what's in here. Uh, so let's, let's go ahead and take a look. 
um, looks like, uh, what is that, a super van? No, another custom 77 Dodge. Yeah. Pretty cool. Uh, what's this here? This is interesting. Oh, I, it's on the tip of my tongue, this casting. I, I'm blanking on it, though. I'm sure you guys know. Really fast roller. All right, here's two jammed into this one. All right, what do we got? This is definitely going to be a vet, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, a Maisto Corvette. And, oh, this one has opening doors. This is a, is that Matchbox? I think so. I don't know, I can't read it. Well, whatever it is, it's a 56 Ford Mustang. Really fast roller. That's pretty cool. All right, what's this here? Um, Mazda RX-7. Looks about right. Adjust this camera just a little bit. There we go. I'm still learning, guys. I'm still just getting back into the swing here. All right, here's a police vehicle. What do we got? A suburban. What up, Ben? If you're watching. Okay, what do we got here? My God, it's shiny. Don't know. This, well, another one. Tip of my tongue. Okay, what is, this looks like a Matchbox. Yeah, Matchbox Corvette, maybe. <laughs> Matchbox always look weird. Yeah, Corvette. Um, with the weird scale that they had back then, sometimes I get confused. Uh, here's a Maisto, another Corvette. Someone's Corvette collection. Not bad. Here's a Dodge race car, NASCAR. Pretty cool. Oh, is one of these alien things? No, not at all. <laughs> Ford GT. Porsche matchbox. That's pretty nice. That's a really nice shape. That's a nice Mustang. Oh my gosh. Fantasy casting. Hyper Lightner. Fast car. Oh boy, oh, we're, we're into it now. This looks like a McDonald's car. Yeah. This is flea market fodder if I've ever seen it. What do we got here? Don't know. If I had to guess, I wouldn't even know what to say. It used to be a police vehicle. It looks, or fire, sorry. Uh, missing the lights. The VW uh, from Maisto. Another Motor Max. Volkswagen, huh? Interesting. Okay, not sure. Oh, this is a Avis Quattro. I haven't seen it in that color. Yeah, here's another, oh, this one's smushed though. Another Corvette. I don't know why people do that. 
Well, some of these are getting weeded out, that's for sure. Oh, this is pretty banged up. I mean, I gotta keep it though. I mean, I keep all the skylines that I find. That's a nice one. Too bad it's so beat up. <laughs> oh God, it's one of these totally generic things. Well, it's a Porsche, but it's definitely an off-brand. Band-Aid race car. This is cool. Camaro Z28. Oh, look at that. Oh. Yeah, Z28. The number on the side confused me there. Oh, but that's pretty sharp looking. Oh my gosh, more crap. Oh, this is like, uh, this looks pretty new. I feel like I've seen these recently. Oh, it's well used though. Another race car. Uh, broken. Another fire department vehicle from Matchbox. Yeah, what do you got here? <laughs> a smashed Jeep. Of unknown origin. And here we have a Hot Wheels. Uh, what is that? Muscle Tone. That looks like it's been smashed as well. Uh, here's a Hot Wheels Chrysler. 300? I don't know. It's loosely inspired by a real car. Uh, here's a nice Datsun. There was that nice Datsun. Um, let's see if I can make out anything at all on the bottom here. I really can't. I don't know. I don't know. But it's pretty cool. <laughs> it doesn't roll very well at all. It's a sheriff department car from Road Champs? Racing Champs? I don't know. One or the other. Again, missing the roof lights. Uh, here's another interesting vehicle, some sort of, I don't know, scraper. Is it a farm implement? I'm not even sure. Firebird, nice race car. Pretty fast. Oh, these I love, man. I know it's a McDonald's car, but I really like this casting and I always keep these when I find them. I don't know what it is. I just really like them, even when they don't roll straight. All right, here we've got from Hot Wheels, a Ford Fusion. Wow, that's my first Ford Fusion, I think. GPD Police, was that Go Gotham? Is this uh, a Batman thing? Uh, okay, this one looks interesting. It looks like a piece is missing in the front there. I don't know. Pretty beat up. All right, this looks pretty cool. What do we got? Not really sure. Pretty cool. Oh, look, it's that pencil sharpener one. That's pretty cool. Man, it's like the best rolling one of the bunch too. Uh, another Corvette. Is this that one that we had that was smashed? It is. It's 
Same one again. This one looks like it's in a little better shape. Who makes these? Matchbox. Interesting. Oh, another McDonald's car. Another Avis Quattro. This one's a lot nicer though. Nice truck. We got custom 69 Chevy. Oh, this is interesting. What is this? Sorry. I don't know. <laughs> it looks like something similar to a McDonald's car where you had to put the stickers on it. It's pretty cool. Some kind of Bronco. That's pretty sweet. A bent axle. All right, here's another police car uh, by Matchbox Sport SUV. Rolls really well. Here's a Ferrari. Let's see how that rolls. Pretty damn good. Pickup truck. GMC. Teradyne. And finally, we ended on a Maisto. All right. We're not done yet. We've got a couple more here to go through. Go through this one first. This case is one of those trucks with side panels with cars in them. So this shouldn't take too long. What do we got here? Another purple passion. Is that what this is? Somebody correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but that's pretty cool. These are the kind of cars that uh, I could give to my daughter and she actually cares. And she only cares that they're pink. Uh, there's, uh, what is this? The car, this must be a, I don't know. I was gonna say it was a character car, but it doesn't look like it. Oh, this is nice. What do we got? <laughs> 69 Chrysler SS. Let's it's a calamity over here. Nice racetrack car. And this one here, this looks pretty sharp. That paint job, it's got like a copper color to it. Uh, Ford Fairlane. There's a limo. All right, what do you got here? Some kind of racer, Camaro? Yeah, Pro Stock Camaro. <clears throat> got a pair of fire trucks. Pretty cool. Hot Wheels, five alarm. Neither one with a ladder. Okay, what do we got? Some kind of fantasy thing? Spider Rider. It's a good roller. A nice station wagon. A 70 Chevelle SS wagon. Really nice roller. It's kind of hot rod. Another hot rod. These are nice. Big truck. This is a Chevy. Yeah, 56 Chevy. That is really cool. <clears throat> All right, get the other side going here. Do this without dropping them, maybe. <laughs> All right, what do we got? Uh, this is Maisto. I've seen this one before. Kind of crazy school bus. 
What is this? This is interesting. Made in China. It's like solid brick of metal. Uh, this is a fantasy car. What's it called? Prototype. Uh, this is some kind of broken thing. Made by Hot Wheels, though. Looks like it was once a pullback. Uh, okay, what do we got here? Fantasy car. Fangula. That's pretty badass. Look at that. I like it. Oh, this one got destroyed. Yeah, that's going to the graveyard. Junkyard. Dune buggy. That's nice. Okay, here we've got... Is this Motomax? What is that? I don't know. Kind of has a plastic feel to it. Is this a Maverick? Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Nice red one. Walgreens race car. I don't think I have that yet. I got a bunch of these, and every time I see a new one, I tend to set it aside. Oh, this is really sweet. This is a Volkswagen, what is it called? Volkswagen type something. Uh, but it's really nice. This one is in perfect condition. It's pretty cartoony looking. Oh, is it a ride? It's a ride on it, but you probably put a Lego guy in there. That's cool. My daughter and I do races down the six lane with uh, ride ons all the time. She'll get a kick out of that. Another buggy. What do they call this one? Roll cage. Oh, this would have been nice. Mercedes, but it's really banged up. Oh, that one's really seen its better days. All right, so one last bag of stuff to go through here. Start with the loose cars. This bag of cars here, 25 cars, cost me 10 bucks. So we'll see what that got me. Oh, that's a pretty good start. This is a Honda. Yeah, it's a Civic. I mean, I, I suppose that's what it is. It doesn't look much like a Civic, but pretty cool. A nice truck look at that that's got to be a chevy oh yeah silverado uh fantasy car oh this, this is pretty cool though this is a what is it called power fire rocket fire but it's got like a skull look to it that's pretty badass every once in a while i keep the fantasy cars and i'm gonna keep that one all right here we've got what is that paradigm shift pretty interesting uh, okay hyperliner that looks like it might be missing some parts <laughs> it's totally made of plastic i thought it was a transformer for a minute there oh wow well speaking of transformers Looks like a movie version of Optimus Prime. Let's see, how do we how do we do this? Oh, that was easy. Okay, there we go. There he is. <clears throat> All right, this next one here is a. What is it? Gotta be a Mustang. Pretty sweet. All right, this one here, Chevelle. That's a nice one. I feel like this is pretty new too. I know I've seen this recently out of a five pack. I don't know, it probably had different tempos, but definitely seen that model recently. Oh, this is cool. This has gotta be a Lancer. 
yeah. Police decal on the side. I'm not sure what country spells police like that, but that's a sweet car. All right, this one's cool. What is this? Twin, evil twin. Um, again, I don't really love fantasy cars, but this one just looks so badass. This looks like something a, a villain out of like some kind of Tim Burton v Batman movie would be driving. Um, here's another fantasy car. Uh, what's it called? Geronimo. Man, really scratching the bottom of the barrel for some of these names. Uh, here's a really cool one. What do we got? Pontiac? Oh, is it a Firebird? Yeah. Wild alien green color. There's a Radar Ranger. I don't think I have this uh, version of it. It's decent shape. Looks like all the parts are there. Still rolls. Here's a SpongeBob SquarePants weather van. What do they call this casting? TV news. All right, another racing car, fantasy car, uh, technetium, and what's this? Uh, I don't know. This is interesting. Some kind of space vehicle. All right, there's a oh, it's a Ferrari. Yeah, F50. There's a, it's gotta be a, yeah, Barracuda. Oh, this is a fantasy casting, but it's a cool one. Um, what do they call it? Oh, it's not, this is the Crown Victoria. I was thinking of the Hot Wheels one that's just called like Taxi. Uh, this is actually really cool. Okay, what the hell? I don't know. I don't know what this is. It looks like part of something and the wheels are all mangled. Oh, here's one of these alligators. What do they call it? Croc rod, of course. This thing looks fast. RD02, really? Is that some kind of character card? I just don't know. Look at this van. Speed box. And what do we got here? Is this uh, fish and chips? Whatever they call that car. I don't know. Pretty good though. Pretty cool. Alright, just a couple more things here, a couple carded cars. Try to end it on a higher note than we've been on here. Um, there was a ton of carded cars, most of them way overpriced, but I found this Tide car for two bucks and I grabbed it. It just, anytime I see a Tide car, I set it aside. I also picked up this uh, Cuda, nice Barracuda. Um, this was like a buck. I couldn't say no to that. And uh, the last one I bought was this uh, Matchbox Premier Collection, uh, number to 25,000, 56 Ford pickup. These are so sweet. Uh, they're so detailed. Um, I tend to open these when they come with a box like this and just, I have a, a couple boxes full of literally cards and Matchboxes. Um, I've never opened one of these before, and I'm curious if it's actually serial numbered on the bottom. Um, you know what? Let's find out. Some of you probably know. I know this isn't super rare because I paid $3 for it, so let's have a look. Okay, uh, nope. There is no serial number. But look at this thing. It's really, really, really nice. Uh, 
and the box also doesn't have one. You guys that were collecting back then are probably shaking your head. Of course, it doesn't have one, but I wasn't buying them at that point, so I guess lesson learned. But, I mean, no point in keeping it closed anyway. And it's got rubber tires. It's pretty sweet. This is definitely a good one to end on. All right, everybody, uh, thanks for watching. I'll be back with another video soon. I've got a lot more stuff to go through. Uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, five more cases and uh, a box with a bunch of random stuff in it. So stay tuned for that. Thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Please uh, comment, like, and subscribe, and uh, I'll be bringing more content like this. All right, thanks, everybody. Take it easy.